In our county of 1.4 million residents, Orange County Utility serves about 870,000 people, more than half of our residents. Since May, Orange County has been actively participating in the CDC's National Wastewater Surveillance System. It is part of a national network of wastewater treatment facilities monitoring the coronavirus across the United States. Today, we're at the Eastern Water Reclamation Facility, which serves over 280,000 people right here in our community. And it's one of the three areas that we sample. Although the results fluctuate, the concentrations of the virus RNA that we're seeing and that we measure show an overall increasing trend in our service areas. And that's what we look for. Not one concentration, but the trend over time. When we started sampling back in mid-May, our concentrations, our concentrations that we were getting in the three service areas were around 200,000 gene copies of the virus per liter. Our latest results from this past Thursday are showing right here in the Eastern service area, concentrations of 2.073 million almost 2.1 million gene copies of the virus per liter. That's a 674% increase from what we had in mid-May. Orange County has been sampling for COVID RNA in the wastewater, and that's a good indicator and a predictor of uh, clinical cases to come, hospitalizations and clinical cases. And that RNA, which are fragments of the virus that are non-contagious, uh, non-viable, those fragments of the virus can give us a really good indication um, and an early warning or a predictor of cases to come in the next four to 10 days. And the reason for that is that in the wastewater, we can see both symptomatic and asymptomatic infections, um, while the hospital is only seeing the people that are only uh, symptomatic. We're sampling twice a week, we're sampling Mondays and Thursdays, and we're using a 24-hour composite sampler. And what that does is taking a little bit of a sample in a 24-hour period. So it's a weighted average of that 24 period. That sample is being shipped to Fort Collins, Colorado, to a lab that specializes in in this type of testing, uh, RNA testing. And we get the results, uh, the Monday results, we get them Wednesday, the uh, Thursday results, we get them on a Saturday. This uh, methodology, which is called wastewater-based epidemiology, is being used around the world as a great tool to fight the pandemic. And again, that's used to determine um, any spikes or outbreaks, uh, the effectiveness of public health measures uh, that are being implemented. This is but one indicator that we are using technology and science to help us uh, predict and project where we may have an increase in transmission within our community. And we can use that to communicate to residents to uh, provide information to them that will help them protect themselves and or get tested uh, should the need arise. The main takeaway concept that this is a great tool that is not new. This process had been used of wastewater-based epidemiology, has been used in the fight against polio around the world, and is a great tool that is here to stay.